Okay, so this is how you slingshot without the use of a Gale Claw. So, when you have the Gale Claw attack, it's a lot easier, but since you don't, this is how you slingshot. Right, or you can use the slope method. Sprint down a hill, and then go flying. Now, when you have a Gale Claw, it's a lot faster. Watch. It replaces your... It replaces your, um, your current glider. But, eventually you're not gonna need the Gale Claw. It is, it gets the job done. Right. Alright, so these are the other gliders that we're gonna be testing out. Celere, Kilamari, and Hongyu. And these are the materials, in addition to Gale Claw towards the end. Let's get started. Let's go get ourselves a Celere. You can find them over here, by the Azura Bay, or you can find them on this side, to the east of Fort Ruins. And you can find them along this beach as well. I should get a Butcher as well. Alright. Here it is. Give me one. Boink. Okay, so this is our regular one. And now we- <laughs> Midway! We got a new one. Let's see how we fare. Let's see if I can get a tiny bit of a descent. Woo! Whoa, look at that glide! That's actually not bad. Woohoo! Goodbye, my dear friend. I need to make sure that I don't accidentally butcher my own pal. My, like, my preferred pal. Like, how bad would it be if I butchered this guy? This one has, like, everything on it. Please be open. Oh, yes. Okay, let's take a gander. Now there has to be Kilimaris in here. Okay, finally, we got one. Bye, friends. And Sayonara. Look at this. We are practically... Oh, my God, what is that? The glide is actually very floaty. We are very floaty. Barely any descent. Yep. Very nice of a glide. Very, very nice of a glide. Oh man, look at that glide. Woohoo! People sleep on uh, Kilimaru. And it's only because... Like, when you're gliding yourself, this is so pathetically slow. But when you get, like, a good, a good, a good, 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 some good value out of it. Like, a good height. Yeah, and a bit of speed. It has to have some speed, buddy. Woo! This is some good, this is a good glider, dude. Let's see if we can get a good, good range. Woohoo! <laughs> Look at us go! Look at us go, dude! Oh my days! It's beautiful. Oh, hello, good people. Not good people, actually. Wee! Oh, wow. Sleep some more on this, why don't ya? Okay, you guys ready for Hanyu? Actually, let me just quick, quickly take these guys. Yeah. Woohoo! I found, yep, De Anubis Desert and the other desert, the more advanced desert. So let me, let's just go teleport over there real quick. Okay, so the best route to teleport there is to go to the Quivern statue and then just fly northeast. The Quivern waypoint, I don't know what it's called. It's like Realm of the Sacred Tooth or something, I don't know. Realm of the Winged Tyrant. Dude, Quivern cannot be a tyrant. He's the cutest dragon ever. Okay, just fly. Over to the weird looking stones. Alright, I hear a shiny. Mister, you are going to end my collection, thank you. Still looking. Oh, but I'm saying goodbye to my shiny. Oh, man. Uh, don't look here, folks. Nothing to see. Oh, look at those IVs. Mmm. Okay, you ready? <laughs> With the Hanyu, it's kind of funny, cause watch. You go upwards. You go up. 
A tiny bit up. Well, actually, you keep going. It's like a hot air balloon. But the ascension, I don't know. I don't know if there's a cap. I've never really looked too far into this. It, it looks like there's a bit of a cap. What kind of? Set, go. Yeah, it's it's pretty good. We're gonna go to my base and see how we do with a reach around, wrap around. Let's see if I can slingshot off this tree. Woo! All right, it, it's not bad. It is not bad at all. Is there another Hanyu? Oh, I, li I like this one. This one has some good IVs. Yeah, we're at 80, 96. Not 100, that's for sure, but it's pretty good. We're floating for a long time, too. I, I did turn down the stamina to, like, negative 4. So, we'll be, we'll be, we'll be floating for a while. But out of all of them, I'd say Hanyu... Is pretty good in terms of glide. Kilimar is also damn good, but wait, wait what is this? We're still going. <laughs> We're still going. What? Do you slope over there? Yeah, that's some good distance. Let's see if we can make it back over to Anubis. I think we can. This is so peaceful. My golly gosh gosh. Oh look, skill for tree. No, that's not it. It's over on that side, past the tip. But yeah, we can kind of make it to Anubis. Yeah, yeah. Another shiny. Too bad we can't. Boink. Let's say you built an elevator, like so. How high can the Tanyu get, get you? Let's see. We are now at one floor. Okay, so it gets you up about three, four tiles high, which isn't bad. Let's see if we can keep it going. <laughs> this is this isn't this isn't bad at all. You don't. Let's say you don't believe in the in the grappling guns, huh? <laughs> oh, that's that's actually pretty cool. Wow. But then, grappling guns can just do that. But, you know, let's say I don't want to climb stairs. My legs don't work. I'll just float instead. Oops, I forgot my legs don't work. This is not bad, huh? That's the good part about Hanyu. Woohoo! Damn! Bring me to Knocklum, taxi! Taxi! Oh, bring me to that fruit tree, actually. Oh my diddly, oh diddly. Oh snap. Help, help, help! No, no! I can't gain my speed! Uh oh, ouch. What we got? Sand Twister? Dang it. Lightning. Also bad. What kind of garbage is that? Oh wait, I forgot. My my mount doesn't work. That's okay. I'll just glide. Wait. So we got. We went from here. Okay, that's not that. That's not as impressive as as I thought it would be. Let's see if we can gain more distance if we were to um slide down a hill. Where's the next tree? All the way down there. Eh, uh, not looking too good here, folks. We all got we got some nice looking gliding though. I don't know if I'll be able to even mimic it. Woo! But that's some good glide. That's some good distance. Well invested uh flying mounts, I'll say, if you can get enough uh kick. Yeah, that's satisfying. We flew- we fly over the border too. I am now illegal. Splash. Where's the ice? Diamond ice? Diamond rain? Oh, how many apocalypse? 
Yes! Five apocalypse, let's go. I love apocalypse. The freaking twisters. Why don't they just call it dark twisters, huh? All the way to that waypoint, please. And thank you. Whee! Where are you, bro? I'm gonna be, I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna fall! Oh my god, my savior. Let's go. Oh, hey, he's back again. Okay. So, Gale Claw, you can get a lot of range, a lot of distance from just merely a tiny bit of a slope, a tiny bit of a... A slingshot? You can get a lot of distance very fast. And it's pretty darn amazing. Oh, what the heck? The tactic of sliding. You have to slide off of a cliff. You can't just go onto a cliff and then just press jump. Because then when you do this, and you jump like that, sure, it resets your altitude to an extent, but you lose out on a lot of speed. And the best part about Gale Claw is the speed. Get the height you want, and then the speed comes after. How far we can go? You know, It's certainly the fastest out of all of them, but I'd say that it has the worst descent out of them all. Oh! Dang that speed. We almost got into that a little uh, hole there. That would've been nice. Yeah, it, I'd say it descends a lot faster than all the other ones, but like just casual gliding. Wow, are we by the Azura Bay? Here we are. Just casual gliding like so, it, it, it does really well. Like even if you do a tiny bit of a... Woo! Yeah, see we lost out on a lot of that speed. But yeah, him, Gale Claw, and probably I'd say Hanyu are my overall favorites. I'm just gonna look at you. Look at you. And the slingshot. But yeah, slingshot with Gale Claw is probably the best tactic. If you can afford to sacrifice a slot for Gale Claw, Gale Claw is not the greatest pal for damage. I will say, like his best, he doesn't even have um, air blade in his own kit. You have to slot it in. He has Gale Claw, which is literally just like Nightwings, except without like the whole, you know, channeling of him coming back and forwards with the tornado, whatever. So, yeah, let's go test him out a tiny bit more. The best part about Gale Claw is that you can use him and shoot things at the same time. You know what I mean? Let's see if we can get there. Ready, set, go. Woohoo! Onwards to our first fruit tree. So let's see how far we can go. Oh, yep. Now, every single time you turn, you lose so much distance, or rather speed. Let's reset. Let's reset. Woo. Let's reset. Oh! Woo! That's the best part about Gale Plus. You, you, can, you can shoot things at the same time. And and literally, it's it's just like Genshin. Where you... But, um... Oh, interesting. Oh, oh there. Where you're able to, um... Glide. With, like, Venti or something. Isn't gliding faster? That's an adjust. Okay, let's keep going. Alright, let's see how we go this way. Now, I do want to say, when you ascend these guys to rank 4, 5, whatever partner skill, the highest as you can go, and slap on all movement speed, you're gonna go freaking far. You're gonna go fast. Like, really fast. But, you know, it, 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 it is what it is. Oh yeah, we lose out on so much descent, dude. Look at this. He's great for short-term distances, but like, I think compared to Hanyu... Oh, please don't reach land. Oh, just barely. Just barely. Okay, so how we, did we go? We went from there to there. It's not the greatest. Um, but yeah, I personally like Hanyu a little bit more. Don't don't tell me Gale Force that. Gale Claw that. Gale Force or Gale Claw, I don't remember. But like... This is this is good. The descent is not 
great, but in terms of speed, it's definitely the fastest. It is definitely the fastest, and you're able to shoot at the same time. Like, watch. Let me see if I can show you guys. Oh, look at that IV. We're moving, and we're shooting. Boom, boom, boom! These guys didn't even stay it. Oop, I missed. But you get the idea. So that's Gale Force. Gale Claw. What is it called? I don't know. I play too much League, dude. 